in a annual service, there's lots of things that are checked. The, the, the running gear, the, sh the chassis, the coupling head, the brakes are checked and adjusted to make sure that you have full braking efficiency and safety. And inside the caravan, there are a large number of checks that are undertaken to ensure that all your appliances are safe to operate on gas, electricity, that you have no water leaks, etc, etc. In addition to an annual service, there are other things that we can do to protect our investment and to protect ourselves as users of these caravans. Every modern caravan, when made, is built to certain standards. One of those standards is electrical equipment installation standards. Part of that standard to which the caravan is manufactured is a recommendation that every third year at least that the caravan has a further safety installation safety check, sometimes called a PIR or periodical inspection report or an electrical safety inspection. Things that can't be easily checked on an annual basis are investigated to make sure that there is no deterioration in the safety of the appliances and the wiring in the caravan. All of the appliances in the caravan will be thoroughly checked. Light sockets, switches will be taken apart to make sure that there's no degrading to the electrical installation. Uh, all of the electrical safety switches will be thoroughly checked, timed to make sure that they perform as they should and as they did when the caravan was new. Here we have a typical selection and array of safety circuit devices. In an annual service, these would be checked that they, manu that, that, that they physically work. But in an in a electrical safety inspection, we would go a stage further. Sophisticated equipment would be applied to the caravan that would not only check that these devices work, but check that they work quickly enough. And we're talking about milliseconds here, okay, to ensure that they're still performing as they should and as they did when new. Okay, if we move further into the caravan and say typically look at a ceiling light on the 12 volt circuit, an annual service would check whether this works on, off. But an electrical ins inspection test would go a stage further and look behind what you can see. Typically it would take the lens off and it would look for any evidence of overheating or, or degrading to the thermal insulation. This is a very good example here. Up here we can see evidence of scorching and burning. On a safety, electrical safety inspection report, we'd recommend that a new light fitting is fitted to this caravan. We could take it to have a look at some of the major appliances, such as the space heater. An annual service would check that it works. An electrical safety inspection would check for evidence of overheating which we see here, distortion here, due to excessive heat rising from the back of the fire. Again, recommendations would be made on an electrical safety inspection that adequate screening is applied. Also, on an annual service, Whilst visual checks are made at the condition of the wiring, that there are no wires loose, that everything's in the places it should be, on an electrical safety inspection, it goes much further. We need to test the insulation properties on the insulation of the cables, such as here. This may look perfectly okay, but over time, the insulation properties on this cable will break down. So a safety inspection test every third year would check that with 500 volts to ensure that that is still safe in that caravan. So it's very important that we service the caravan every year to protect our investment. It's also very important that we do have this every third year safety inspection to ensure that the things behind the scenes are safe and are in the same condition they were when we first bought the caravan.